close calls caught on camera. Focusing attention this morning on drawbridge safety. Our transportation correspondent, Gio Benitez, is looking into several recent cases. Good morning, Gio. Hey, Michael, good morning. Yeah, this is something we really have to pay attention to, whether you're in a rush to get somewhere or simply just caught off guard. The incidents we're about to show you prove that this can be incredibly dangerous. This is the moment over the weekend when a motorcyclist tries to cross a raising drawbridge in Daytona Beach. The man driving through the traffic arms, and as the bridge rises, that motorcycle sliding onto its side, the man falling off. The bike now dangling over the waterway, causing the bridge to shut down. Police say the man was not injured, but was issued a citation for careless driving. Authorities temporarily shutting the bridge down to inspect any possible damage. It's just one of the several incidents of people either trying to beat the bridge or getting caught off guard. I see one lady. I don't know how to explain it, but she fell out. 79 year old Carol Wright was killed last month walking across this bridge in West Palm Beach. Her family's attorney saying the bridge started to open without her knowing. She was in the middle of the bridge, and when the bridge went starting up, she fell 50 feet to the concrete. Who do you blame for this tragedy? The bridge tender who works for Florida Draw Bridges Inc. They have several safety protocols. They have at least three cameras there on the bridge with monitors inside. So they're supposed to go out there and physically uh, and visually check the pedestrian crosswalk and the vehicle uh, traffic area. Attorney Lance Ivey says he is also representing a man who was stuck on a nearby drawbridge in November 2020. That moment caught on camera. At one point, he holds on and the bike falls. And late last year, a drawbridge opening up with a car still on it. The driver attempting to get out until the car rolls down. People may be surprised to hear that this happens a lot more often than we think. Our goal here, among other things, is to prevent this from ever happening to any other family. And we should tell you, we have reached out to the operators of these drawbridges, but so far this morning, we have not heard back. Guys. Oh, those are some scary yeah, scenes. It sure was. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.